Humanity's greatest journey begins not with a step, but with a leap. Aboard the starship Prometheus, pioneers prepare to bridge the vast emptiness between worlds. Prometheus to ground control. All systems are go. We're ready to make history. Across 54.6 million kilometers of cold space, five vessels carry the dreams of Earth. Athena, Apollo, Hercules, Orion, and Prometheus converging on a world that beckons with crimson allure. Athena to fleet, Mars is in sight. A new horizon unfolds before us. In unity, they descend, a ballet of engineering and hope, touching down on the alien soil of our neighbor. This is not the end of a journey, but the beginning of mankind's boldest adventure. Prometheus has landed. Athena, touchdown confirmed. Hercules, we are hunting. Apollo, boots on Mars. Orion, stable and ready. On this day, Mars is no longer a world of desolation, but a canvas of possibility. Welcome to our new frontier. As the dust settles from our historic landing, the crew of Starship Prometheus springs into action, laying the foundation of what will become our first home on Mars. Prometheus base to all units. Habitat module is secure. We're moving to life support setup. With every panel placed and every bolt tightened, the dream of living on Mars inches closer to reality. Meanwhile, aboard Starship Apollo, a green revolution unfolds. Hydroponic systems spring to life, promising a future where Mars not only sustains us but nourishes us. Apollo Greenhouse to command, we have sprouts. I repeat, we have sprouts. Each sprout is a beacon of hope, a testament to life's persistence in the harshest of environments. On the Martian frontier, Starship Hercules delves deep into the red soil. Their mission, to mine the essential minerals that will build our future on this new world. Each scoop of regolith not only brings us closer to self-sufficiency, but also uncovers the mysteries lying beneath Mars' surface. In the quest for knowledge, Starship Athena emerges as our link to Earth and the hub of scientific discovery. Their research lights the path forward, ensuring our survival and prosperity on this new frontier. Athena based to Earth, our first Martian data is ready for transmission. Science knows no bounds. Powering our dreams, Starship Orion's crew works tirelessly to deploy the solar arrays that will energize our colony. With each panel that unfurls, Mars becomes less of an alien world and more of a home. In these early days of our Martian saga, optimism fuels our relentless drive. Our habitats stand firm, communication with Earth anchors us to our origins, and the essentials of life flow abundantly. Together, we are riding humanity's next great chapter. On Mars, we are not just survivors, we are pioneers. As we settle into our routines, Mars reminds us of its untamed nature. A dust storm, larger and more fierce than any simulation predicted, descends upon our colony. Orion to Prometheus, we're losing solar efficiency fast. These panels are choking on dust. The storm tests our resolve, our preparations. Power dwindles, communications falter, and visibility near zero. Our mission, our very survival, is threatened. Apollo, we're losing our crop lights to power cuts. You need to fix this, or we'll face food shortages. Do you understand? This isn't just about us, it's about our future here. As the storm rages outside, so too does the storm within us. Frustration, fear, and the fierce desire to overcome. But within this crucible of challenge, the true strength of our colony is forged. Together, we must adapt, innovate, and prevail. All ships, Orion here. We can't let this storm break us. 
we're getting backup power online. Let's tackle this head on together. As the storm outside lashes against our fragile hold on this alien world, one cannot help but wonder about the nature of these Martian tempests. Unlike anything experienced on Earth, a dust storm on Mars can envelop the entire planet in a shroud of reddish haze, lasting for weeks or even months. These global events, known as planet encircling dust events, can dramatically alter the Martian atmosphere, obscuring sunlight and testing the limits of our resilience. The duration and intensity of these storms remind us of the relentless challenge Mars poses to human ingenuity and survival. As we stand amidst the swirling dust, the question looms large, how do we endure, adapt, and thrive in the face of such overwhelming odds? As the red skies clear, revealing Mars in its silent beauty once more, we emerge from our shelters. The storm, one of Mars' formidable trials, has passed, but its impact lingers. Now, we face the task of rebuilding and preparing for the challenges yet to come. All teams, report in and initiate recovery protocol. We have resupply ships on standby, waiting for our signal. Let's clear the decks and get back on track. Each crew, reflecting on the storm's lessons, begins the meticulous process of cleaning and repairs. Solar panels are uncovered, communications restored, and mining equipment dug out from under mounds of Martian dust. It's a testament to our resilience, our refusal to be daunted by the challenges of this new world. Power systems are great. Solar efficiency is back to optimal levels. We're ready for the resupply ships. Over. As we prepare for the arrival of the resupply ships, Starship Hercules makes an unexpected discovery. Beneath the surface, cleared by the storm's ferocity, lies a vein of minerals, unknown and potentially invaluable. This discovery could change everything. But with this discovery comes new questions, new challenges. What secrets does Mars still hold? And are we prepared for what lies ahead? <laughs>